6 Home Remedies to Help Reduce Tinnitus Tinnitus, or ringing in the ears, is an uncomfortable symptom which can happen continuously or at intervals. It can be a quiet or loud sound in one or both ears, and it is sometimes accompanied by headaches, insomnia or learning problems. It starts in connection with infections and age-related hearing loss, but it can also occur as a result of the accumulation of earwax or damage to the ear. Although it can seem normal to have tinnitus for a bit, lack of treatment can lead to difficulties. Over time, it becomes more difficult to hear and to concentrate on daily tasks. For this reason, it's essential to treat it as soon as possible, to avoid exposure to loud sounds and to bear in mind some home remedies that help relieve it. Discover them. One comma consuming ginkgo biloba is one of the natural solutions to fight both the ringing and inflammation in the ears. This plant has anticoagulant and anti-inflammatory properties that help to improve circulation and thus reduce this annoying ringing sensation. Also, since it has antifungal and antibacterial effects, it can help to treat underlying infections that affect this problem. Ingredients 1 cup of water 250 milliliters 1 tablespoon of ginkgo biloba, 1 OG. How to use it? Mix a tablespoon of ginkgo biloba with a cup of boiling water and drink the infusion twice a day. You can also get it in the form of compresses or extracts. In the latter case, Take between 120 and 240 mg per week. Ginkgo biloba. 2. Basil. The antibacterial properties of basil can be used to help treat both pain and ringing in the ears. Its natural properties help to fight infections and also help with getting rid of excess earwax. How to use it? Put several basil levels in a blender and blend them until you have a paste. Put the paste through a strainer and press it to obtain the juice. Warm the juice, and when it reaches a suitable temperature, apply two or three drops to the affected ear. 3 comma apple cider vinegar. Thanks to its natural antifungal and anti-inflammatory acids, apple cider vinegar is another effective solution against the underlying infections that cause tinnitus. Its properties balance the alkalinity of the body and improve its response to external agents that cause illnesses. Ingredients 1 tablespoon of apple cider vinegar, 10 milliliters. 1 glass of water, 200 milliliters. How to use it? Add a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar to a glass of tepid water and drink twice a day. Optionally, Dilute equal parts of apple cider vinegar and water and apply three drops to the affected ear. 4. Comma garlic Garlic is a natural remedy that can fight tinnitus when it is caused by low temperatures or sudden changes in altitude. Thanks to its qualities. 
it helps to reduce inflammation as well as improving the blood circulation to the area. And as if this wasn't enough, it also has antibiotic properties that prevent infections and facilitate the cleaning of the ear canal. Ingredients. 2 cloves of garlic. 1 tablespoon of sesame oil, 15 grams. How to use it. Fry 2 ground cloves of garlic in a tablespoon of sesame oil, and then filter it and let it cool. Put 2 drops of the oil in the ear canal and tilt your head for a few minutes so that it can take effect. Repeat every day for a week. 5. Ginger The medicinal properties of ginger help to fight tinnitus thanks to its ability to improve circulation and fight the pathogens that cause infections. Its anti-inflammatory compounds reduce the inflammation of the ear and calm the sensation of pain and tension. Ingredients 1 half tablespoon of grated ginger, 5 grams. 1 cup of water, 250 milliliters. How to use it. Add half a tablespoon of grated ginger to a cup of hot water and drink the infusion two or three times a day. Optionally, cut a slice of raw ginger and chew it for a few minutes. This exercise will control the pressure in the ear and reduce the ringing noticeably. 6. Comma Mustard Oil The antifungal and antioxidant properties of mustard oil can be used to control tinnitus and infections. Applying it helps to eliminate excess wax and create a protective barrier in the ear canal to prevent inflammation and attacks by bacteria. How to use it? Warm a little mustard oil in the microwave and then put three drops in the affected ear. Tilt your head and remove the excess ear wax. Use three times a week. Does this uncomfortable symptom bother you? Trial any one of these remedies and discover how they can help deal with this problem. However, avoid combining several of these remedies at the same time, and if the problem persists, consult a doctor.